Well, think Pequot Lakes and what image comes to mind? Most likely it's the iconic Bobber Water Tower. For this week's In Focus, Sarah Winkleman takes us into the Pequot Arts Classroom where students are working on a bobber of their own. Mar this up too much and you need to come back in and pencil yeah. in. Dan Devine is teaching his art students while they are working on sculpting a replica bobber. It started off with a base, then you started to like add on things. A transformation from a lump of clay to a sculpture representing the iconic bobber water tower, the symbol of Pequot Lakes. It's pretty mm -hmm. good. Yeah, it looks really good. It was really cool to see how everybody added on to it and how everybody created a part of the bobber. Over 150 students and some staff members have all put some time and effort into the bobber, all adding their own additional piece of why they love Pequot Lakes. I think it's fun to see what everybody else thinks of our town from other perspectives. A collaborative effort that Divine hopes will build his students' confidence. I'm trying to make sure that they are trying to overcome those maybe little fears, um, and it's okay that, that and you might mess up and then you can try it again and clay is pretty forgiving to do that that's a nice medium to work with a material that goes through many stages over the next few days as the project nears completion the different stages that the clay go through whether it's a, a wet stage to then a, a stage that it starts to firm up to then a bone dry stage um, and after it gets all the way fully dry then it'll go through a firing um, temperatures up to 1900 degrees um, once it's fired it'll be solid as a rock the sculpture will be fired in three separate pieces, glued together, and then taken to its future home that is still to be determined. Possibly getting this out into the community and letting uh, other businesses have this uh, housed in their space. A project that has given students pride in who they are and the community that they live in. Just that unity um, and what uh, others can do as they come along with one another, knowing that each kid is important and what they do, and, um, and hopefully that they can see that as they grow and as they build that they're an asset to society. A positive message inspired by the Pequot Lakes Bobber. For this week's In Focus, Sarah Winkleman, Lakeland News. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.